Afro-descendants in the Revolution of Independence. During the War of Independence, different subaltern groups participated in the fight against the realistic authorities. One of them was the Afro-descendant population who raised up in arms in favor of the insurgent ideals. During the French intervention in Spain in 1808, Viceroy Iturrigaray is dismissing New Spain and the political crisis deepens. Therefore, different groups of conspiracies began to emerge that saw the autonomy and independence of New Spain, as well as the one of the mulatto Mariano Tavares of 1808 in Acapulco. Leaders like José María Morelos, who is attributed with mulatto origin, allowed the integration of several Afro-descendant communities under the insurgent flag sharing ideals of freedom and justice, and the abolition of the payment of tributes. There were also Afro-descendants who joined the realistic troops, such as those of the Costa Chica and Oaxaca. In both cases, the military meant a way to ascend socially. Vicente Guerrero and Juan Álvarez, also of Afro-American origin, continued the struggle after the death of Hidalgo and Morelos alongside these communities. They saw their wishes fulfilled until 1829, when President Guerrero officially abolished slavery, ratifying the measures decreed by Hidalgo and Morelos. Secretaría de Cultura Gobierno de México